She was born in 1922 to Chicago University. About 17 years later, she was retired and sent to live in the basement of the stadium. In 1954, Colonel D. Harold Byrd suggested to Moton Crockett that he go rescue her and bring her back to Texas to be the sweetheart of the Texas band. Of course, I'm talking about Big Bertha. And today marks her 100th birthday. Happy birthday, Bertha. My name is Rami Anton. I'm the founder and president of A&F Drum Company, birthed right here in Austin, Texas in May of 2016. I started the company with $2,500 and have built it to be the fastest growing drum company on the planet. So three years ago, a Texas alum and friend of ours, Kyle Bunting, referred us to the University of Texas band to come and give Big Bertha some love. At 97 years old, we quickly realized that Big Bertha was on the verge of retirement. But how do you replace her? Such an iconic presence for the University of Texas. At ANF Drum Company, we're no strangers to making odd-sized drums by hand, but this was a whole different level of drum. We purchased the finest materials in the United States, gathered some of the best craftsmen in Austin, Texas, and handmade the biggest and strongest bass drum in the world. Standing at nine and a half feet tall and four and a half feet wide, she is the biggest bass drum in the world, made for the best university in the world, the University of Texas. As the original Bertha retires, we will continue to celebrate her in the UT Athletics Hall of Fame. So without further ado, please direct your eyes to the center of the field on behalf of the University of Texas, a &F Drum Company, and Kentex Metals. This is Big Bertha II.